Welcome to Gran Turismo 7, and today we're gonna review it again. Well, two cars I have already reviewed, but I gotta re review it again because I, I know pe most people are gonna asking, are you gonna compare it to in the, the newer Corolla, GR Corolla and the GR Yaris, which is currently ha have now? Yeah, y yes, I, I aware people got it are talking about it later. Yes, it does me. Hey, okay. if I if I may, yes, I will, will review it again. So as you know, people already on the YouTube, I have a fanat fanatic of the Toyota G Yaris. Yeah, yeah, I gotta say. Okay, we, we have, as you know, people already. I, I well, thank you very much. I reviewed this one is about three years ago, which is in 2020. Actually, this car came out in 2020. The G Yaris high performance, G Yaris high RZ high performance, but engine on it. It's got 1.6 liter inline 3 turbocharged engine, 268 horsepower and 370 newton meters of torque. Or okay, this the European version has 261 360 newton meters of torque. I was re remember if I correct me if I wrong. I, I will put in the stack of in the link in the description uh, on the box uh, in the box. box I uh, description box uh, uh, later because I they do already. So this one has 268 horsepower, two, and one thing, 370 newton meters of torque. Weighs about 1290. Yeah, 1290 kilograms is pretty much uh, less than the not Mitsubishi to the a Mitsubishi Evo. It was actually and the car, the car on the normal saloon car. <laughs> well, the over and also four wheel drive and manual gearbox. That's what. I'm talking about people. All gotta, I, I gotta say, yes, it was. Yeah, it was available for every country. It's said in North America. Uh, from, the, from the previous video, the GR Corolla, uh, I re reviewed. The GR Corolla uh, came in with the all over the world, including North America market. But this, uh, this one, and the GR Yaris hasn't come um, in the North America market. I gotta say. So uh, people already know I have a bunch of color. Uh, or it has a bunch of colors. Emotional red, two platinum white, platinum white, white pearl mica, super white two, and precious black pearl. Well, I gotta say, precious black pearl is pretty much. Uh, yeah, it does. That's pretty cool, actually. I already have the two version. You may know I read the review and one of them complete modify like for tribute the GR Yaris tuned by Kansai service. It is. So the super white too, I really love this one, and I got it, already have one of these things already. D don't worry. Now the the main one of the main thing as well, the one of the main on this video as well, uh, actually the Giac Corolla. As you know, I reviewed it yesterday. And, well, actually, I reviewed it two year, two days ago. I recorded this one here is a, a Giac Corolla Morizo edition. If if you have the Morizo ed edition, it doesn't have a back seat. As well, and and the luggage is so very large. Put I put in a lot of stuff, you know. So this one here is the same engine, 1.6 liter inline three turbocharged engine as the GR Cor GR Yaris. So the GR Corolla has the same engine, and as the GR Yaris has a, a six-speed manual gearbox as well, and the 300 horsepower. This one is 300 horsepower and 400 newton meters of torque. Weighs about 14.45 kilos and one thing is, it's 155 kilos heavy because of the two, uh, this car has twice as many doors and also so quite a lot of torque and also uh, quick. The rivalry between uh, but Gia Yaris and Gia uh, Corolla is uh, has a good differences. And one thing about Gia Corolla is five door hatch. The three door hatch like uh, Gia Yaris is also cool as well and because of this one here is between rivalry on the Honda Civic Type 4, Vauxhall Corsa VXR, oh wait Vauxhall Corsa VXR or <laughs> okay the the Ford Fiesta, Fiesta ST I know people got the Ford Fiesta ST is already finished out of production and already so the, between it on this car with the Honda Civic Type R and it wasn't on the hatchback a hot hatch right now have the Golf GTI <laughs> yeah the Golf GTI is too around uh, and still available so I know people are gonna think are you gonna race both these cars yes let's get on
I gotta say, both these cars are pretty much fun to drive. Uh, f such a f fun to drive the car. Well, well, fun to drive actually. So the GR Corolla is a, a cool. The cool thing about GR Corolla, this is a, a high performance version of the Coro Cor Corolla already have. As you know, mostly Corolla Corollas came with a hatchback or saloon or or now, which is a uh, called Cross Corolla, which is a crossover version, which is I not fan of. It, but I love the hatchback and here we are at a hatchback Corolla uh, like this one the GR Corolla Morizo edition so the Morizo edition is pretty much um, it's quite amazing and very very quick as well if you don't know what Morizo is the nick the third it actually is a nickname for Akio Toyodaji the one on the the man behind the man the behind the legend of the GR which is a gazoo racing on development on this one I know people thinking wow wow Akio Toyoda is a very, not just a he one well, that's his CEO of Toyota current now is a Sato san I believe is Sato Shacho and, and also even known today Akio Toyota is, is quite he would work so hard to bring the Gazoo racing stuff yeah uh, Gazoo racing yeah it is uh, the GR stuff when they, 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 he bring back Akio uh, Toyota bring back the Hachiroku he bring back the Toyota Toyota GR the name Supra name back he bring the, the GR Yaris as well and then Corolla uh, GR Corolla as well and also GR Hachiroku as well yeah oh, wow and it was actually so the the other car the GR Yaris yeah this is a one of uh, still one of my favorite hatchback of all time and also homologation for WRC car it was homologate for WRC even though these days are very very it's quite nimble humble and also well, is the coolest rocket po pocket rocket hatchback ever yeah, if you don't know about it Rowan Atkinson have one of these things as well well uh, if you don't know Rowan Atkinson okay you uh, you, you gotta hurt me this he will, Rowan Atkinson is Mr. Bean and also Johnny English as well. He, like Rowan Atkinson, who who also previously owned McLaren F1, but this car here, the G Yaris, is one of the coolest hatchback ever. What is coolest hatchback ever came came out in the 2020. The Gia Corolla came out in the last year, I believe, the 2022, which is a, a coolest thing ever. And I like it both these cars, the Gia Corolla, uh, which is a the Morito edition and also normal Gia Corolla and also this one Gia Yaris <laughs> yeah it is so thank you so much for watching this video if you want to see more Gran Turismo 7 or other video on this channel be sure to smash your like subscribe if you are new follow me Facebook Twitter Instagram and also Hoyo Lab link in the description box below see you guys soon assalamualaikum and goodbye